welcome bags. Becoming an intercultural church is easier said than done. It takes time and a lot of work to make it happen. Well, welcome to us all, welcome to you all. Whether you come from near or from far, it is good that you and we are here. And bringing together people from across the church, across the country, and across cultural lines to talk about intercultural challenges and opportunities is a critical part of the evolution. That's why all these people have come to Winnipeg to talk and learn from each other. I came to conference for a number of reasons. Uh, one is I was at General Council this past summer and experienced worship that was held in a variety of languages, a variety of different styles, and discovered worshiping when I don't understand what's being said gave me a different experience of God and of God's mystery, of God's wonder, and realized that's something we usually don't get in our worship services. So that was one of the reasons. One is I live um, in the part of Winnipeg is a community called Transcona, which is a suburb on the very eastern side of Winnipeg. Winnipeg is one of the cities in Canada. Lots of refugees, lots of immigrants move here. And they begin to move out into the suburbs. And we're starting to see that in some of the suburban areas. I volunteer and teach uh, sketching classes at a K-6 to class. And was in there last week with the grade four students. Uh, had a variety of kids coming from number of different countries which I wasn't seeing even eight years ago when my kids were there so as a church in that community we need to start to become more more aware I think I'm also here biblically because um, I'm coming to an understanding that to be the church biblically is to be diverse both Paul's message of we don't have rich we don't have poor there's not male female uh, slave free um, in some way, to be the church means to intentionally go out and bring a diversity of people in, or else I think somehow we're missing who we are as a church. And part of it, I'm here because um, when it comes to being intercultural, I probably don't feel particularly competent at it or really confident, comfortable in it. And I, some of my experience is that God sometimes gives us the blessings when we go to the places we're not very confident in. So I'm here for that reason too. The Mission and the Service Fund helps support gatherings and events across a country where United Church people can create a 21st century experience of Pentecost and feel the Spirit of God move across languages and cultures so we may become part of the one body of Christ.